In this video, we're going to learn about how to reply to activities in Seesaw. Make sure that you've clicked on the Activities tab. Scroll through to find the activity that you want to reply to, and then click the green button that says Add Response. It's only through here that you can add a response to that activity. If you're not sure what the activity is asking you to do, click View Instructions for more information. Some activities allow you to be creative in the way that you answer them, whether it's taking a photograph, shooting a video, uploading something you've already made, or drawing something new. The drawing button has a lot of unique features. Let's have a closer look at that now. In the drawing tab, there are lots of lovely features on the left-hand side, including typing text, recording a voice, adding in photographs, or using the shapes and backgrounds. On the bottom right-hand side, you can add more pages if you need some more space. You can even duplicate and copy pages. If you've not quite finished your work or want to come back to it later, you can click the orange draft button in the corner. When clicking this button, the work is saved in the activity and can be easily found. Some activities have a template already added which means the teacher wants you to reply in a very specific way. Hit the Add Response button. When a template is added, you cannot add in extra features like videos. You can still add photographs and write on the board. There are lots of different pens at the bottom to choose from, and you can even change the color and the width of the pen to make it easier to write on the board. So remember, to complete an activity correctly, click the Activities tab Click the Add Response button, view the instructions, and think about how you're going to respond to that activity. Thanks for watching. See you on Seesaw.